Hi, welcome to SBR Videos. I'm Peter Loshak, continuing my coverage of the 2015 NHL playoffs. Right now, we're going to take a look at the Game 1 lines for Ottawa at Montreal. And uh, right now, Montreal is a pretty decent-sized home favorite. Right now, they're minus 147 at Pinnacle. Ottawa's plus 133 on the other side, and the total is low, as expected. It's 5 juice to the under. And uh, maybe the biggest factor for this game, of course, is the status of Max Pacioretty for uh, Montreal. And the last info that I've seen on that is that he's unlikely to play in game one. And of course, that's going to be a pretty big hit for the Habs. Uh, the keys to the series and game one as well are basically exactly how awesome Carey Price is going to be in goal for Montreal and how well Ottawa is going to be able to extend their a huge surge from the second half of the regular season into the playoffs. And it's not at all guaranteed that Ottawa is going to be able to maintain that uh, because they're they're mainly driven by youngsters with very little NHL experience uh, to say nothing of NHL playoff experience but that's also a two-sided coin because they're also presumably uh, gonna be playing relatively pressure free since they've already outperformed their expectations from the middle of the year but Montreal having price in goal is a huge plus for them for sure and obviously if he pitches a shutout they're gonna win game one but scoring could be an issue for Montreal. It's probably going to be a problem for the Habs even with Pacioretty. And uh, now without him, it could be a significantly bigger problem in Game 1. So this is a tough one. The Habs are so reliant on Price, and that is scary when it comes to uh, the postseason. But still, as awesome as he has been this year and as experienced as he is in big-time situations, I don't want to bet against uh, Montreal in Game 1. And then for Ottawa... You know, Andrew Hammond's awesomeness was completely unexpected, and his bubble could burst at any moment, of course, and no one would be surprised by that. But with Pacioretty out and Montreal not too deep in the scoring department, my pick for uh, game one is going to be on the under five at minus 119. And if Price has, you know, his typically awesome performance and Montreal doesn't get any unexpected offensive production from somewhere else in the lineup, I think that the under is probably going to be the best way to go in this one.